I am Jennifer and welcome to my channel. I like to try things that are new to me that may not be new to you. So we may have something in common. We may have an experience to share together. So go ahead and put your comments below and we can have a conversation about what happened to you when you tried whatever it was and I can tell you what happened to me in my video with however it was. Uh, something that I have been super curious about is these angel lift. I don't know if you've heard of them, but they're hydro gel surgical grade uh, derma strips that can go ahead and help you with the appearance on your face. Well, what does that mean? <laughs> so let's talk about my face a little bit. I am 48 years old. I am going to be 49 this year and proud of it. But with age, as everybody knows, things change on your face. And I have been noticing my uh, nasal folds here, the marionette lines. I noticed that they've been more uh, creased or deep set. And I'm like, ugh. Ugh. what I don't like about it is it's, I'm, I'm totally fine with aging. I don't have a problem with that. It's I like to wear makeup. I do. I really enjoy makeup. I'm learning makeup and I'm new at doing makeup on top of that. So maybe I'm not using the right makeup products, but I notice like my makeup will go ahead and set in my lines here. And that's what I don't like about it. Um, so I want to see what I can do to try and correct that or fix it. I'm not ready to do surgery on my face. Maybe one day I'll do surgery on my face. If you've done surgery on your face, I'm happy for you. No judgment. If you haven't done surgery on your face and you're like, I don't care about my nasal folds here, then okay, I'm happy for you too. <laughs> it's whatever makes you happy in your life and whatever you're comfortable with that you can feel, you know, you're most confident. There are the options of doing uh, fillers along my face. I'm... I'm such a sensitive person when it comes to even just taking vitamins sometimes that I don't feel comfortable doing injectables into my face. That's something that I just don't think I would ever do. Honestly, I think I would probably opt for surgery before I would opt to go ahead and have an injectable in my face because I'm just afraid of what would happen. I don't want to have any type of allergic reaction or anything of that nature. If you've done that, I'm happy for you. I'm glad it works for you, but I guess I'm just a chicken, so fuck, <laughs> just tell me I'm a chicken. Um, and then the other thing I could do is I could do uh, fat transfers on my face. Fat transfers, I'm gonna do a little bit more research on that. I mean, that, that may be something that I do, just being honest. It's not a yes, it's not a no, it's I would say a maybe. Maybe one day I'll do fat transfers um, because my thought process is, and again, I need to do more research on it, is it is just taking fat from my body and putting it somewhere else. My body is already used to the fat in my body. And God knows I have a lot of fat in my body. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm being silly. Um, also, my face, I haven't had any plastic surgery done or anything. So this is me just with um, probably, I would say, like my everyday makeup on. Um, I don't have uh, any fillers. I've never done any type of filler in my face, which again, if you've done it, I'm happy for you. No judgment. I just, I, I haven't done um, anything to my face in that way. I did have... Um, a deviated septum surgery on my nose because one of my uh, nasal passages was 80% blocked and the doctor went ahead and fixed that to the best that he could so maybe one day will I have a nose job that's a maybe too I don't know because my nose is pretty crooked <laughs> Which, okay that's fine I don't care I, I I'm not like super vain uh, I, I'm kind of okay with my crooked nose because I've had it my whole life so I, I'm used to it. Um, dental work, I only have a fake tooth. Uh, I did have braces when I was in my 30s, so I guess if you consider that cosmetic, then I've had that done. Um, I had LASIK surgery done to my eyes in 
99 and that worked for about 12 years and now I have to wear glasses at night when I drive, which I do. I don't have to wear them during the day. My vision's fine, I don't know, according to whatever tests my eye doctor does. That's what he tells me to do. So just to give you a little bit of history on my face, I really haven't had anything done. So this will actually be like my first cosmetic thing to do to my face, which is using these derma strips. Uh, I did go ahead and purchase these through the Angel Lift site. They come in this nice little compact case. Uh, that gives you a little mirror there, so you don't have to see my ring light. <laughs> and then there's also a book of instructions. They're packaged really well, and it just lets you know the different options through the Angel Lift uh, company that you can get. They come in this nice box. <laughs> I did go ahead and try using these a few months ago, but I fell off the wagon. I just, I got too busy with life. So I decided, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and try and give this another try. Uh, but I'm going to be consistent and why don't I go ahead and film it and let you know if I feel if this product works, if this product doesn't work. Uh, these are the two uh, derma strips made out of the hydrogel and it does say angel lift on it it is uh 69 for the basic set so that's what i got was the basic set and um what they do is they actually help train your facial muscles to go ahead and not i guess concave in if i'm using the right word so they go ahead and help train your facial muscles. If I remember correctly, uh, they came across this noticing with stroke patients that to help them, you know, because when you, you, you talk, you may not realize it, but you do use a lot of facial muscles. And when you have a stroke, unfortunately, you lose some of that. So going ahead and putting um, a, a strip in there to go ahead and exercise that muscles, they noticed that uh, the marionette lines, the nasal labial nasal folds, if I'm saying that right, uh, were disappearing on people. So that they, they, that's where Angel Lift came in, I want to say. And they went ahead and created these to go ahead and offer this as an op, a option for somebody who doesn't want to go ahead and have surgery, which I thought, hey, why not? $69, what do I have to lose? Uh, when I did use these briefly a couple months ago, um, I did notice I had a lot of slippage when I put them in on the top and when I put them in on the bottom, which that's normal. Um, that uh, That's normal because your muscle's not used to it, you're not used to wearing it. Uh, it is recommended in your pamphlet, so you'll definitely wanna make sure you read this and you wanna read on the site all of their FAQs. You know on what to do with these you don't want to eat with these you don't even want to talk with these in so when you put these in uh, just go and pop your favorite you know TV show in or read a book and I set a timer for 15 minutes uh, I think you can go ahead and build it up to 30 minutes wearing them so you want to go either 15 minutes a day to 30 minutes a day wearing these but you don't want to talk you don't ever want to sleep with these in I mean, really, why would you want to? Because they could just fall out of your mouth or something worse could happen. So you just want to make sure that you relax and wear them and then just take them out and be on with yourself, whether you go to bed that night or be on with your day or, you know, whatever it is. But it does take a while for your muscles, like just like your arm muscle or your leg muscle to get used to having that tension in there. It could take up to seven to 10 days before you stop feeling the slippage in the movement uh, while you're wearing it for that 15 minutes. So just keep that in mind. So my plan is I am going to wear them for a month. <laughs> I am sticking to a plan. Today is September 1st and I'm gonna wear them every day for the month of September. So this is my beginning video so you can see what I look like. at the beginning of September to see where we're at. And I'll go ahead and snap a picture of me 
so I can see where my marionette lines are at and then do maybe a follow-up video I'm not sure maybe I will maybe I won't um, just depending on what results I have from these maybe I'll just wait until September 30th to go ahead and do the final follow-up video uh, for you to see the comparison we'll see I don't know we'll see where I'm going with that uh, another call out on these hydro uh, surgical grade uh, derma strips is they do last uh, four to six months so this isn't something that you can just keep and keep using and using and using you will have to replace them I mean if you really think about it in your mouth you have a lot going on with your saliva um, depending on you know if you have a lot of acid in your mouth depending on what you drink or eat you know maybe that could go ahead and constitute the breakdown of these I don't know do they break down I don't know I will let you know I'll let you know what my experience is on September 30th or if not sooner on uh, how they perform like wear and tear wise so I'm gonna get right to it I'm gonna go ahead and just pop these in my mouth I washed my hands before I started my video and I can kind of feel a little traction so I think if you can kind of see there's like little bumps right here once I put these in my mouth I'm not gonna talk to you because they're gonna slip and they're gonna move so I'm gonna put them in and I'm gonna uh, wave goodbye but I'll be back in 15 minutes to take them out so you can watch me take them out as well so you know what to expect if you're interested in this product so I see the little dots right here so I'm gonna kind of center it up Ah, red. <laughs> my teeth. Okay, and shove it up in there. <laughs> See, it slipped out. <laughs> some saliva there um, so I did wear them for the 15 minutes and I went ahead and took them out I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse them with water when I'm done before I go ahead and put them back in the case I mean the case is really nice to have so that way you don't have to worry about you know dropping them or misplacing them you can just rinse them off pat them dry and then put them in the case I mean I guess in theory I really kind of need to read the instruction manual to make sure that that's right but that's what I'm gonna do right now uh, just for uh, documentation purposes, just so you can see, it is definitely uh, September 1st. So when I go ahead on maybe the middle of September or the end of September, just depending on how I feel or what's going on in my life. <laughs> if I'm able to do um, a mid video, I will definitely do the video on September 30th. I'm just not sure about the one in the middle of September. We'll see. I don't know. And I will give you my honest feedback on what I think about the Angel Lift. It's something that I like. If I feel that it works, if I feel that it doesn't work, I will let you know. So until I talk to you then, I hope you take care of yourself. I hope you drink plenty of water because water is important for beautiful skin. <laughs> and until then. Mwah.